So this is the cyclone, not the one that we're picking up, but since we're waiting, we're gonna take a good walk around. What do you think, Laura? You ready for this? Yeah. I think this is dinner level. Wow. I have a feeling this one's gonna be. Oh, okay. Well, Not this like is just the... nice. Not like the temp trailers from uh, our day. Holy cow. This is a toy hauler. Yeah. With a bath and a half. Yeah. Do what? It's got a bathtub. Got I would a bathtub. At some point we'll graduate up to something. Yeah, but yeah, we don't use the bathtub us. now. A big closet. Check this out and look at all the storage. That is probably going to be the hardest thing on ours. Is the bedroom. But we will figure it out. And eventually, who knows? Walk-in closet. Yep. King bed. Nice. It makes a difference when you've got the slide out in the bedroom. Yeah, it does give you that extra room. Yeah, and that's the one thing ours is missing. But <clears throat> the living area is, I think, more roomy and nicer than this. Sorry. <laughs> yes, this is, well, I don't know. This seems like a little bit of a compacted area to me. That's what I'm saying. Ours feels more open and roomy, the one we bought. I do like the four gas, four burners. burner gas stove, though. Ours has three gas, which we'll figure out. I'm not much of a cook anyway, so. And this is a Furion residential refrigerator. So it looks like two. T90 toilet. A lower and an upper freezer. Yes, the car hauler section has another layout for bed and it has a half toilet and TV. Yep. Not bad. So. Yeah, this here is for the ultimate uh, off the grid or. Oh, and we have a bed up there for. Ah, uh, yeah, you have a loft. Yeah. See if I can get up there. They used a lot of, they used this space well. They don't. And it's got a back door anything and here's the ladder right here so it have rear entrance to the toy hauler side door awnings all the way across then of course your massive massive ramp here which also has a awning side ladder i think this comes out you can do it as a porch yeah Plenty of storage. Hey, and where you turn your gas on and off. My hair. Can you? Do you see it here? Nope. Right no. there. Yeah. Hold on. Just a little bug. Stink bug. Got him. Okay. Laura just had a stink bug land in her hair. I, I felt it kamikaze my head. Fifty amp. One, two, three side outs. Slide outs. Slam doors, own struts, and look at this. Got a TV in the pass through. Here's our city water, fresh water, washout connections. This one's got a liner in it, plastic liner. Nice propane tank. Well, actually a smaller propane tank. I'm surprised. There may be more. Wow. This is a nice little electrical closet, hydraulics closet. Inverter. Inverter. We might have gotten this access, fern access to your pass through. And I just clopped there in the head. I think it was on purpose, people. And it's got a 5,500 watt generator on board. Wow. Definitely set up for off 
off grid. Boondocking. 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 You got the pass through. Let's see what this here is. Oh, we have a slide out grill. Want to grab that side, Laura? Yeah. Nice. Great. Griddle. So this is nice. That is really nice. Made by Greystone. And a little bit of storage that goes back in here. Plenty of storage. Oh, we have a storage here in the main pullout. And that's gonna be your little hot point. So your refrigerator is on the opposite side of your stove, but that's Which, nice. And got some storage there. That is actually a little bit. Well, they're, I mean, they're on the same side. They're just pretty separated. Yeah, solid stairs. You gotta work it in where you can, right? Mobile rod suspension, triple axle.